Hello, and welcome to a quick look at some of the new features in Jamf Pro version 10, which is now available on Trams Cloud. The first thing you'll notice is the new user interface. Jamf have gone to great lengths to make the user interface as simple to use as possible. Breadcrumbs have been added to aid navigation. The new side menu is collapsible. and also features icons that are consistent throughout the design, as well as contextual warnings and information on relevant pages. One of the most useful new additions One of the most useful additions to version 10 is the new options within patch management. You can now create patch policies based on individual patches for each of the softwares in the list. This list is maintained by Jamf. This list is maintained by Jamf and likely to increase in size over the coming releases. Before you can create a patch policy, you first need to make sure you've added a relevant package to that definition. For example, we'll go into Microsoft Word here and check out the new definitions page. Go to Edit. I want to sign a package as you can see these version numbers are now the same but we also have an older patch that we can apply we'll save this can now go into patch policies, create a new patch, look at the target version, we can now configure how the users get the patches either install them automatically or make them available in self-service. We can scope as you would with normal policies and we can set user interaction as we would usually. Another new feature that many users have been requesting for a few years now is the ability to brand a self-service app. This has been added into the web interface and it's very simple to achieve. Just go to settings. Computer management. Self service. And choose the new feature here branding. Hit edit. And you can simply drag your assets onto this window. This preview will live update. You can also change name here.
That was just a quick overview of some of the many new features in Jamf Pro version 10. I hope you found the video useful and we'll be back with more very soon.